I've been uh, venturing around Laos now for the last two and a half weeks. Two and a half weeks. And I hope you'll forgive the utter sin that I've committed in that time in regards to alcohol consumption. After you, sir. Right, you've got to watch these mopeds. Because in that duration, all that I've consumed is one single beer of Laos many beers, seven or eight to be specific, which is, which is of course, be allowed, the, the OG. And in my opinion, the tastiest, even though I haven't sampled the rest. So, in this quest, watch your traffic, Christy boy. In this quest, we are going to find those other beers and consume them all, no matter how long it takes me and how much it costs. So, join me and let's see how much uh, damage I can do to my liver and my, and my wallet. And uh, yeah, let's see what fun we can get up to. But for now, number one on the hit list is Beer Lao. So, cheers to that, guys. Mm. Damn, that's good. It's not just one sip you have to have. You have to have multiple. Okay, first one down onto the next. I believe it's Beer Lao Gold. So, let's go and uh, see who's selling us the Beer Lao Gold. Nice bike. This market is all packed away, but uh, in the mornings it's absolutely rammed, full of different foods and uh, many people. It's a good time, it's a good vibe. Let us consult the list. Number one has been checked off, which is the OG BLL, which I bought for 17,000 kip. And I'll put the uh, British pound and US equivalent on screen now. So the second search is BLL Gold. A couple of boats there on the uh, Mekong River, having a dock. Oh. Oh. But still no beer, Lao Gold. So we're taking a path and hopefully finding a bar or a vendor this way. Sabadi. Yeah. I seem to have lost my way. Let's try it here. Some rickety steps. Fuck. Hey. So. Feel out gold. Lovely. Come try. How much? Twice? Not 25, 35. Fuck. Paid 17 for that other beer lao. It's because it's down on the uh, on the Mekong River. 35,000. So this is the spot we were enjoying. The second beer on the list, which is Beer Lao Gold. Brewed with a uh, precious da 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 Lao Brewery Company Limited. Lovely, good branding too. Let's uh, do the taste test. Damn good, delicious, refreshing. Another sip, please. Good beer, not the best prices. Cup chai, cup chai. Cheers. Yes, sir. Be allowed dark. Right here, Chrissy boy. Let's get it. Uh, not today, not today. Another day, but not today. Cop chai, cop chai. The tuk tuk drivers, if they don't succeed in selling you a ride, and I mean a tuk tuk ride, not the other sort of ride, but they will try and upsell you that sort of ride if they fail to sell you the tuk-tuk ride. And also weed, weed women, and then they'll downsell you coconuts and then upsell you boat cruises, all sorts. The tuk-tuk guys know where it's at. And uh, 
hey they'll get you somehow they will get you somehow but uh yeah for now we're walking through the quiet streets getting away from the uh the hustle and bustle of the Mekong river and those fucking treacherous prices that we just got sold but anyway hey on to better things be allow dark it's in our sights it's in our sights I'm trying to uh, drink all of the beer laos, so thank you for letting me film. Nice shop, nice shop. Okay, so we're looking for beer lao dark. Aha, we have it. On to the uh, third beer lao on the list. Beer lao dark, which we paid, one second, excuse me, 23,000 kip. Okay, so much cheaper than the previous down on the river. Okay, so, be allowed dark. Cheers. Taste test. Oh, nice. That's all, I can, that's all I've got. Nice, it's good. It's cold, uh, it's fizzy. It tastes like, uh, tastes like beer, but it actually says dark lager. So, it's not beer, it's a lager, but it's from Laos. And uh, yeah, it's third on the list, so we're drinking it. Next up, on to Bialao White. I should have maybe considered filling my belly just a little bit with food before I uh, embarked on this quest. Hey, again, you win some, you lose some, right? That you do. That you do. It's some uh, ceremony with the uh, with the monks here at the temple. There's donations, but I don't think they accept beer. Now on to the fourth beer on the list. I am looking for a beer lao white. Sorry, I disturbed your eating. Beer lao white. Is it good? How much? How much? Uh, Eighteen. Eighteen. Good. It's a good price. It's a good price. And then you've got the IPA there, which uh, which we'll get to. That's great. Thank you. Cup chai, cup chai. Yes, please. So we've done it. We're on to the fourth BLR, which is BLR White. And uh, we're going to take a seat now before heading down to the night market, just on the side of the pavement. And uh, hello. Hello. Sabadi. How are you? All good? Good. 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 good thank you. Let's check it off. Taste test number four BLR. Oh my goodness. Need some water and food. But anyway. We go on, we go on. Cheers. Cool branding, what it says. Beer Lao, white beer. Same again. Lao Brewery Company Limited. Brewed with the finest ingredients. So, uh, cheers to that. Taste test. Smooth and nice and um, uh, thirst quenching and cold. And it tastes like beer. It tastes like beer. So, cheers. Another sip to that. Thank you very much, be allowed. It's good to be here. It's good yeah. to be here. It's good to be here. Cheers. Man, I really need a piss. Four beers in. Well, almost four beers in. And uh, I haven't had a slash in like an hour or two. And it's probably been an hour since we began this quest. So I'm due a, I'm due a toilet break. Long Pavan? Your favorite? Yeah. I just like the original, the original Bialao. <laughs> yeah. But all of them, they're all pretty good. They're all pretty good. I'm, I'm going through the list. I'm going through the full list. Uh, so, started with the original and then going down to... Is this one? This on the edge? So it's uh, Lane Aksang Lager. Lane Aksang. <laughs> no? No. No. Okay, well, yeah, we'll see what we can do. Hey, Kop Chai. One for you. Oh. One for you. 
Kop chai. Enjoy. Kop chai. Kop chai. Oh, thank you, hey. thank you. No, all good. <laughs> I give it to you. You go. Oh, okay. Kop chai. Oh, give it to you. This is the uh, night market. We've got amazing temples in the background. Great sky. And uh, food stalls that lead all the way down. And various items that they're selling. I like this combination. That's a good combo. If I had any money, apart from beer money, maybe I'd spend it. Look at that sky. The Lao people are so warm, kind and welcoming. Um, I could spend another two and a half weeks here. And the rest. And the rest. And also uh, the hostel I'm staying at is super cheap. Comes with free breakfast and three days a week. Free evening meal for only three or four pound a night in a six bed dormitory. So it's pretty cool. What is this? Uh, whiskey. Yeah. Scorpion whiskey. Ah, okay. Can I try? Yeah. This one, that whiskey, uh -huh. can make from like black sticky light and white sticky light. I'll take the uh, the strongest shot. This 50%. The strongest. 50? <laughs> yeah. 5 0 percent. Okay. Kop chai. Kop chai. <laughs> Bottoms up, 50 percent. What's that called? What's it called? What's the name? Uh, Lao Khao, Lao Whiskey. Ah, okay. Cheers. Fifteen <laughs> percent, <laughs> but this. Okay, we'll have another. This uh, Lao Lai Sawai. Okay. We've been uh, sidetracked with uh, spirits now. Fuck me, that was strong. Wow. Uh, one five percent, fifteen percent, as opposed to the fifty. So we give this a go. Poor man. That is burning. That is burning all over. That's better. Still. Whew. This one is a black sticky light. And again? And again? Okay, okay. 15%. 15? Okay. Man. I was feeling it before, but now, uh, yeah. Cheers. Okay. Very nice. I like it. It's good. It's good. I'm going to have a hangover tomorrow because of you. Okay. Thank you very much. Man, I can't do any more. Call me a pussy, I don't care. We're going to have to split this into two days. Otherwise, I'm going to have a hangover from fucking hell tomorrow. Okay, it's been like 20 minutes of walking around, so uh, maybe we can push one more beer. What have we got going on here? Let's summon the list. Long Prabang. Yeah, beer, beer, beer. Yeah, yeah, which is your favorite? Yeah. Which, which is your favorite beer? No. No favorite? Everyone. I'm, what I'm trying to do is drink all of the beer laos. All of the beer laos. So I've done, I've done one, two, three, four. And now on to Long Prabang. Yeah, yeah. It's good. Yeah. So I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be all wobbly. Twenty thousand kip, and we're gonna get. You can pay with a, n a number of bills here, but we are paying with a hundred thousand kip note, and we're gonna get two beers because uh, there's a guy in the store who was really nice to me just then, and uh, we're gonna buy him a beer. So. Let's get uh, the little boy an ice cream as well. Hop chai, hop chai. Sir? Beer for you? Beer? And uh, four. Sir? Okay, hop chai, hop chai. Enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. Number five on the list. Long Prabang. Beer, artist edition. Cool branding. Let's see if it's got a cool taste. Sabadi. <sighs> Again, 
real good. It's smooth, it's cold, it tastes like beer, it tastes like artist edition, so it's good. Hi. Can I bring myself to do it? There's two more on the list. There's two more. Come on, I'm feeling it, mind. Number six, we're summoning it. We're summoning the list. Number six, can you see it? It's Beer Lao IPA. Oh. Still haven't had a piss either. So that pit stop I needed for a piss, we've made it. We just walked into a, a random hotel and uh, this is the uh, toilet we made it to. Well, this is the door. Home sweet home. Some advertising for some boat cruises. A fan, me, a sink, toilet roll, urinal, a gold toilet. Ah, I'm not sure what that is. A sign asking me not to litter, and then some toilet roll. And then a picture of some candles. The toilet's positioned really oddly because, well, it just is. So we walked in on a scale of one to ten in terms of drunk. Uh, I don't know where I am. Maybe a six, or maybe a seven, who knows. Okay, back out to the mean streets. See you there. So after that last video, after that last beer, I fell into somewhat of a state of disrepair. Uh, I ate something that uh, my belly definitely didn't agree with, and I will leave it at that. But I've been out for three days, completely zonked, uh, just chilling in the hostel, recovering, craving a beer, but now we're back out, still in Long Prabang, same mission, just three days later, and uh, I think it's number six on the hit list, on the Beer Lao list, which is Beer Lao IPA. So we've got two or three remaining, so we're gonna get this, uh, this mission finalized, and uh, anyway, let's see what we can find. So let's roam the streets, let's hit a shop or a bar, and uh, check off. Number six, be allowed, IPA. Hello, hello, hello. Be allowed, IPA. Number five on the list, you have. Hello! You're a funny dog. Hello. Hey, hey, you're not allowed any of this. No, you're a funny dog. Can I pay for this, please? How much? How much? <laughs> Uh, how much for Six this one? Ten. Uh, you're funny. You're funny dog. The fifth beer on the list. IPA. Be allowed. It's been acquired. Cool branding. What it says is Be allowed. IPA style beer. Lao Brewery Company, Company Limited. And it is 5% uh, strength. What are these ladies selling? <laughs> Hi. Some sort of uh, chocolate rice cakes and then some non ripe bananas and some other fruits. Okay, let us do uh, the taste test. Ah, damn good. Damn good. It's smooth, it's bubbly, and again, it tastes like beer. It's good, it's got a nice uh, tang to it too. Sort of uh, citrusy. Hi. It's a uh, gloomy day here in Long Prabang, in Lao. A little overcast and uh, yeah, I've changed out my vest and I put a hoodie on. Shocker, right? But uh, still good, still good. It's a good day to have a good day. Be allowed IPA. That was uh, 16,000 kip. I'll put the equivalent up on screen now so you can see. So we are on to number seven. So right here, this is the bridge that separates one part of Long Prabang from the other. I've been over this on the moped a few times, but I haven't walked it. 
So you've got mopeds that travel through both ways in the center and then your walkway either side, left and right. So uh, we're gonna have a walk through and I'll show you what's on, uh, on the side. And this now, what you're seeing is the Mekong River. One beer at one o'clock, fuck. I'm already feeling the effects. Poco, what? And we're coming to the edge. So typical in uh, Laos streets and of Southeast Asia, you've just got various stalls and vendors on each side of the road. Uh, some selling food, some repairing mopeds, like so, food, moped repair. And then just general shops for, uh, for snacks, lots of water. Not sure what that is, but uh, I am not gonna try it. So it seems you have to resort to getting it from a shop instead of a, like a vendor or a bar because there's, uh, there's not much down this way. So in we go for the potential seventh and final beer on the Lao beer list. Lao beer green. Hi. Okay. Thank you. Ah. Here it is. We've got the can version. That's what we're looking for. Yeah. It's good? Yes. New beer. Nice. Single origin with rice. Brewed with rice. Right. Rice? Yeah. Nice. How much? 20,000. 20,000 kip. Oh boys. Which is uh, cheaper than some we've had, but also more expensive than some. But overall, the law of averages is playing, playing out quite well. So, uh, be allowed green. Let's be having you. Check out those cobwebs. Well, there it is. The seventh and final beer on the list. I'm totally... Uh, Cancelling out that eighth potential beer just because I don't think my liver can take it anymore. So be allowed green brewed with single origin rice Limited edition anniversary celebration of 50 years Cheers to that and uh, we're gonna finish this video off. I hope you enjoy. I hope you've enjoyed it And uh, you can take in some of the background scenery the beautiful scenery here in Lao Long Prabang of the Mekong River so cheers and I'll see you in the next one.